disparity of team's performance in games. The Wolverines have lost three times before October for the first time ever. Hope has battled criticism about refusing to wear a headset during games that he's not plugged into what his coordinators are trying to get accomplished. But he spent Monday dealing with something much more serious. Questions about why the team let quarterback Shane Morris stay in Saturday's loss to Minnesota after a hit that clearly dazed him. Morris was already dealing with an ankle injury when he got leveled by the Gophers' Ferry and Cochran in the fourth quarter. He got up, he had to lean on a teammate for support. Hulk said he didn't see the play when it happened, but he didn't question his team's process after. We would never, ever put a guy on the field when there's a possibility with a head drop. Felt like he could still play. When the injury happened, and, I, and I'm not going to get into all of this, I'll let uh, our medical people talk about it, but when the injury happened the first time, he came back and could play on it. Tells the competitor he feels he can play on. He comes in, when he comes back in, hands the ball off, checks the play, checks it the right way, does it, uh, everything he's supposed to do. Michigan Athletic Director Dave Brandon apologized for mistakes surrounding the Morris incident. He said there was a serious lack of communication between the coaching and medical staff because they didn't see when Morris was hit. Brandon released a statement early Tuesday morning. It said, in part, following the game, a comprehensive concussion evaluation was completed, and Shane has been evaluated twice since the game. As of Sunday, Shane was diagnosed with a probable mild concussion and a high ankle sprain. That probable concussion diagnosis was not at all clear on the field on Saturday or in the examination that was conducted post-game. Unfortunately, there was inadequate communication between our physicians and medical staff, and Coach Hope was not provided the updated diagnosis before making a public statement on Monday. This is another mistake that cannot occur again. Let's go Royals chance.